Tableau Reader is a software you download and install at your PC. You can use it only to view reports and dashboards, but you cannot use Tableau Reader to create any data visualizations or even edit it. As you can see, we don't have any tools or functions to create charts. You can't even connect any data sources or refresh your data. Tableau Reader is a very old tool from Tableau. It was created in the early days of Tableau in order to share content built using Tableau Desktop. This was before even Tableau Server and Tableau Cloud made available. At that time, Tableau Reader was the only option you have in order to share dashboard and report with other users. So how it works? You build data visualizations using Tableau Desktop and then you send a file to someone else. Then they are gonna use Tableau Reader in order to view and interact with the dashboard that you built. So to summarize, Tableau Reader is a free tool. It is just to view and interact with report and dashboard built using Tableau Desktop. You cannot create or edit anything in Tableau Reader. You cannot refresh the data inside your dashboard using Tableau Reader. Each time you have to ask for a new copy if you want to have fresh data. And there is no security features, password protections, or login option. This is a big problem. If the files lands in the wrong hand, your organization data could be exposed. Well, I don't recommend at all using this tool in organizations. The risk is just too big. But if you want to take the risk and to share your visuals with one, two, three persons, then use it, but try to avoid it. Tableau Mobile is a free mobile app that you can download at your smartphone or your tablet. You can use it to view and interact with Tableau reports and dashboards published to Tableau server and clouds. So you can use it only to view the reports. You cannot use it to create new reports or to edit the reports. While Tableau Mobile is free to download, it requires a license to use. And it can only access Tableau server and Tableau cloud, so you cannot use it in order to access Tableau Public. And Tableau Mobile gonna automatically cache your reports and dashboards in memory. That means you can access them even if you are offline. All right, so with that, we have an overview of all five Tableau sharing products. And next, we will compare all the five Tableau products side by side. And I will walk you through my decision-making process to choose the right products for you. 